Oh dear lord, there's a lot more to walk and fall. <laughs> Good morning guys. Oh, it's such a beautiful day outside today. As you can see there's finally blue skies. It's not all covered in like smoke and stuff. It's such a nice clear day. Oh, I finally have a full, a full day of work. Because lately I've been like trying to work as much as I can to save for Canada like you guys know. So I've been like literally working every day and I thought finally I have a full day I could just vlog with you guys and just basically just take you through my the run of my day when I have an actual day off. I have a fair few things I need to do like at least look into booking flights today. I did email the Camp Canada people and I'm going to um like I've actually checked that email that they, were, that they sent back but I want to start looking into like the actual like booking my flights because I have the dates confirmed now of when I'm actually going over and I know when I kind of want to come back home so I'm like I'll check and I'll like kind of start looking into actually booking the flights which I'm so excited about <laughs> but yeah right now I'm just basically gonna like set up breakfast I had a bit of a sleep and today I was meant to like meant to I was going to like aim to go to the gym today um, this morning, but then I didn't really get to bed till late. So I thought, mm, like, I'll just go tonight instead. So I was going to do, like, the double hit of the gym, just because I haven't been going last week because I was so sick. Like, in my previous vlog, you would have heard my voice. It was so bad, but I had, like, a full chest and head cold, so I was like, oh, I won't go to the gym. But... I think that's a helicopter. But, yeah, so I'm feeling so, so, so much better this week. Thank goodness so I'm going to go to the gym today tonight and then like you're yeah, just trying to fill in my day with all the things that I actually have to get done. I have a few um, product review videos that I get to film today. I'm so excited. So they'll be up on my channel too. If not yet, like if not already, then they will be up very, very soon. Mm, so I know this isn't really like the most flattering of angles. This angle will do. So basically I've only just gotten up. It's like 8.30. Like I said, I was going to aim for the gym at 5, but I didn't. I was too tired. Excuse me. I mean, I had morning, so I had a double shift yesterday, so I'm still a little bit, like, recovering. Uh, actually, I'll show you guys what I take, because when I was sick, I was taking, like, vitamin C. I take these, like, herbal supplements that I get for, like, my naturopath, but the vitamin C, I feel like, makes the biggest difference. I mean, your body really needs, like, vitamin C to, like, help its immune system, so I'll show you the one that I use. So... What I was taking was this C Bioactive um, Vitamin C. I only take about one scoop of it, of course. Like, check with your doctor or whatever before you take it. I don't want to, like, recommend anything too bad. But um, this is literally just, like, vitamin C. So I was taking this. I take one scoop of it, which I'll show you now. So I haven't put this in water, you can put it in like juice or something if you want. I mean it's got a pretty strong like citrusy orange flavour I guess. But um, the thing with taking this is that you have to take it about 6 hours or so apart from the last dose that you took because otherwise your body, it just kind of flushes through your body. Like your body's only going to absorb a certain amount of vitamin C and then any excess amount is just going to flush right through so it's like 6 hours apart that you need to kind of take it but I only take it once a day in the morning when I remember and I was only really taking it, well I only really take it when I'm sick I don't take it on the on the daily I mean today I'm taking it because I still have a little bit of a scratchy throat sorry this lighting is just not doing justice so yeah I've still a bit like a scratchy throat but nothing too bad so, so I'm just taking it, this will probably my, my, be my last dose and then I won't take it until I'm sick again <laughs> Which hopefully is not soon. So I might even have breakfast slash lunch like a little bit later. So I haven't been feeling that hungry. I usually, like I said, don't really have breakfast unless I've been to the gym and stuff. I'm actually properly hungry. I had dinner pretty late last night as well because I got home pretty late from work. So the extent of hours between food isn't that long. But actually what I wanted to show you guys, I did have this, I did this like a mini haul from the online shop Baby Boo. So I'm going to do like a little try on haul of those. I got four different dresses, but yeah, I'm actually quite happy with the purchases. So I'll show you guys that. I can show you that now actually, why not? Okay. Okay guys, so I've got the collection of dresses next to me. 
So I'm happy with about the majority of them. So the first one I purchased was a nude cinched up style dress. So this dress is actually the Eve mini dress in the star, in the color nude size medium. On the actual website it says like for my size personally that I should be a small but in just in previous experience like online shopping I was like no like I'll go for the medium. Um, just because the small has always been too small for me. So this one was a perfect size. Um, it fits like a glove. It's so comfortable the fabric. The cinching I think is really cute. I'm a big fan of like it kind of tight fitting and it kind of hugs your waist a little bit more. And like your bust and your butt and everything. I like that preferably on me and it's just more tight fitting and secure. The fabric is so soft. It's such a gorgeous colour on. Like. I found, because I'm quite tan, I can kind of pull it off per se. Um, my sister tried it on and it was a little bit too, like, she was a bit too pale for the nude colour. Like, it kind of washed her out a little bit. Um, I liked it. I think it looks good on. Um, so, if you're a little bit lighter than me, uh, can maybe think twice about it just um, in regards to the, the colour of it. It's quite light. But I found it was quite flattering on my skin tone. By the way, I don't mind the change of light we're experiencing here today. So it's quite tight fitting. I found it really comfortable, like I was saying. It's about midway along, like midway length on my thighs. So it's not just tucked under the butt. And it retails for $55.95. It was on sale when I got it. I also got the similar style dress. So the Eve mini dress. This is in burgundy. So this is the other one. They only have two different colours. The nude and the burgundy. This is such a beautiful shade too. This one actually retails for... 69.95 so it wasn't on sale it was a little bit more expensive i got the size medium again in this one again fits like a glove it's so comfortable the fabric's really stretchy basically everything i said with the nude applies to this dress and i found dancing because this is one i went out in the other day i found like actually dancing in it was so comfortable like sometimes if I'm, i've got a dress and it's like too tight or too you know it rides under the ass just a little bit too much um I'm spending the whole time like pulling the dress down but like the other night it fits perfectly you don't have to worry about it riding up. All the dresses that, that I've bought from the site all have adjustable straps which I love so much. I can't tell you how many times I've bought an online like dress or shirt or something like it's had straps and they haven't been adjustable and it's just too low on the boobs so I really appreciate that. Okay, next dress I purchased was the Savannah mini dress in white. This one retails for $79.95. So this is the dress here. It is so stunning. As you can see, it has little, um, like, what would you call this? I call them little bands. It kind of like secures it to your boob, so it like lays flat rather than like flipping open a little bit. So it's quite hugging and tight fitting on the boobs, which is really nice. In this clip, I'm wearing like a strapless bra. So that's why I have a bit of a push-up bust. But usually it's just quite tight-fitting to the boobs. So it'll hug them quite nicely. You will feel really secure in them. You don't have to wear a bra with them. But I do recommend like nipple covers. Um, again, it's cinched on the sides. Which I really appreciate. Because it hugs the body. And it makes you a bit more... It's more flattering on the waist and the butt. Um, it's also got that nice like stretchy fabric as well so it's so comfortable you can do a lot of drop and lows and stuff drop and lows you can move around quite easily and everything and dancing and everything if you're going out clubbing or something in this and did i say i got the size medium as well in this dress as well i don't think i think all the dresses i got i got a size medium in i think you could get away with this fabric it being a little bit more like smaller because it is quite stretchy so if you did get a size smaller it would be okay. Also, I love the little knotting at the big, at the front. It helps it keep quite secure to your boobs. It hugs it really well, like I've said. And yeah, I love the adjustable straps. Final dress that I got is this little baby right here. So this one is the Yasmine mini dress in red. They had a black, a white, and maybe another color as well. I preferred the actual like red I think it was more flattering on me so the Yasmin dress retailed for $89.95 and I got the size medium the actual style of it is like a bra so it's kind of hugs your boobs gives them a bit of lift this one however is quite tight like the fabric is not stretchy at all it's quite like sleek so it's like sucks your legs together kind of thing I could have gone for a size up in this however like I was kind of more conscious of like the bra size because I'm a B slash C 
I wanted something that would kind of give a bit of like lift to my boobs. And this one does. It's quite secure. Um, the only thing is it's quite tight on my body. Like I feel like I could have gone for a large. But I wouldn't know how like my boobs would have fit. So that's kind of what I struggle with like being <laughs> mid between like a B and a C. So I was a bit like, mm, like what should, one should I get? On the site it says I should have gotten like a small. And I was like, thank God I did not get a small. I would not have been able to fit in that dress. The fabric's more of like a... S like a, what would you call this, like a satin. It sticks out a little bit, it doesn't quite, like it hugs the body, but there's also a little bit of like a gap at the back of the dress. It also comes with a zipper. The other ones don't have a zip to them. This one has a zip. Also has adjustable straps, so you can make them tighter, looser, whatever you need. So that concludes my little mini haul for you guys in this vlog. So let me know which one you preferred, whether it was one, two, three, or four. So I'm a little bit hungry now, I think I might go get something to eat. <laughs> Hey guys, so I think the last clip was me doing that try on haul. So I just gone and had breakfast and I just filmed my Carbon Cocoa Magnetic Face Mask review. So I'll have that video. If not up yet, then it will be up like within the next week or so. So I think I might just spend the Arvo just editing a little bit, like doing a few bits and pieces around the house. I know I was going to go to the shops today. But I think I might not. I think I've got too much to do at home. So I might go to the shops during the week instead. But yeah. And I want to get a little like. <laughs> like I've still haven't got the face mask. Like on my hand still. It was an interesting review. Let's say that it was an interesting review. <laughs> uh, but yeah. So I'm just going to go edit for a little while. And then I'll catch you in the next thing that I end up doing today. <laughs> Hey guys, so it's about like 4.30 in the afternoon. I was going to go for a walk um, before, but then I had a bit of a snooze, a bit of a day nap. I was so tired. So Ness and me are now going to do the tree. Woo! So here's all of the Christmas decorations. And it was so funny, as a kid, me and my sisters and my brother, we'd all fight over placing this one decoration on the tree. If you got to put this one decoration, like, on the whole tree, like, you basically won at life. <laughs> decorations we can't seem to find them so we've half decorated the tree i'm not sure where they are i have to have a look i'm gonna try and put this on ari these little antler ears ari who's feeling the christmas spirit this year oh my gosh look how cute you are she's like get them off me okay guys so i'm about to head off to the gym now so i'm probably gonna wrap up the vlog for today now, I didn't get to doing the flights for Canada, but I will let you know what I end up booking when I actually do get to it. But I mean, I got a little bit distracted with like the tree and everything and my day nap. I'm trying to like eliminate day naps. That's literally what I'm trying to do because like it's just a bad habit that I've gotten into that I'm trying to kind of wean myself off. So we'll see how that goes. So for my gym outfit, I'm just basically wearing these like Elite 11 um, tights and crop top. This is in a size extra small. This is in a size small. I probably would have gone up a size with this one just because it is a little bit tight. But I mean, it makes your boobs look good, but it's just a little bit too tight. Like, it's just probably a little bit too snug. But it's alright. Like, I make do it and it's pretty comfortable. But yeah, I'm going to head off now, guys. Have an amazing day. Thank you so much for sticking through this vlog. If you did like it, please make sure to leave a big thumbs up. And any requests for any future videos or vlogs or anything like that down below. Have an awesome day guys, I love you all so much and I'll see you soon. Bye!